Good morning, good afternoon everyone. Today I'm going to talk about my book, The Innovation Blueprint book. This book is all about in improving your innovation skill. And I'm planning to talk about one particular story, which is story number 51. It's all about like, what are the different types of questions which you can ask, which can challenge our thinking ability. So the question is one of the powerful things. So most of the questions are what if questions, like what if our approach the problem from the opposite perspective, if we really direct, trust this one, how might we solve this challenge using completely different technologies? What are the underlying assumptions that uh, we are making and are truly valid? If failure was an option, what bold step should we take? Some of the questions, these questions are the triggering point through which you can really come out with the different innovative ideas. So questioning is very powerful, mind it. So you should have a stock of questions which can actually trigger the innovating idea. How can you completely redefine the way we deliver value to our customer? Again, the question, what unexpected opportunities could arise from this apparent obstacle? So look for the obstacle. So if we are starting from scratch today, how would we design our approach? What are our competitors not doing that could revolutionize our industry? So these are some of the questions which can trigger some of the thoughts. What if we focus on solving a completely different problem than one you're currently addressing? These are some of the questions which can enhance your creative ability. Now, what are some of the questions Airbnb might have asked? What if people could rent out spare space in their home instead of staying in hotels? This is a fundamental question which Airbnb asked, which has come out with such a big organization. Uber, what are, what are the powerful questions Uber has asked? What if getting a taxi wasn't easy as a requesting as a ride from your phone? 3M post-it notes, what kind of powerful questions they might have asked? What if there were a reusable adhesive note that could be easily removed and reapplied? These are some of the questions initially someone might have asked. So the question is, is very powerful of enhancing your creative development. Like Netflix, what if people could rent movies without having to leave their homes? Tesla, what if electric cars could be a powerful, stylish, convenient as gasoline powered vehicle? So obviously the questions will be around the unmet needs and pain points, uh, challenges existing paradigm and industry norms, uh, spark creative solutions and completely new business model. So ask why five times, like why, why, why what's happening? What if, how can we? That kind of questions like so questions are the fundamental so while doing this one you play a devil's advocate because that's quite important important that like the, as long as you have been coming from the opposite direction and constantly challenge your questions challenge your thoughts yourself possibilities are there you may come out with a completely different proposition embrace what if scenarios look for the analogies or parallel in a completely different industries and fields that will trigger for a completely new innovative ideas are you really doing it in your current assignment are you constantly thinking around this what if solution how about this car looking for the pain points uh, looking for the obstacles and what are the different opportunities will come out if you really continuously do these um, obstacles now these are the disruptive questions. These are the disruptive questions which is challenge our conventional thinking. What we have been doing it for the long time, it may not be the way which it's supposed to be. What if, how might we, and underlying the assumptions, if failure was an option, what could be the, what the bold steps would be taken? What would our solution look like if we had an unlimited resource? Like when you force yourself to think from that dimension, now obviously you will come out with a lot of different propositions which may not exist right now. This will obviously challenge you to really come out with a different proposition. So these are the different types of tactics or techniques which can help individuals to really come out with these innovative ideas on a daily basis. So these are some of the structured way of diverting your mental thought process in, in much more mature way. So like this way, there are many techniques has been written in this book. This book is for everybody who would like to really enhance their creative ability in today's AI driven world where everything is going to be automatized. If we are not challenging our current way of working, if you are not challenging our current thinking process, obviously some of the things will be automatized. But from our whole perspective, we need to be ready for this particular, it should be a second nature. Like it should be a natural part like where you are constantly come out with a, this kind of proposition where you are constantly redefining your work, work purpose, redefining your currently always working. And through this, you will become better creative individuals because it's a journey. You are constantly cultivating these habits on a daily basis. And after one year, two year, three year down the line when you're constantly repeatedly practicing all these things, you become better at what you are doing. You become great creative individuals known into the industry. So hopefully you will look into this book and see that like how this book can transform your life. Thank you so much for listening to me.